As I travel around the country and meet all kinds of people who are interested in exploring franchise opportunities, I am asked all kinds of questions. But here are five of my most frequently asked questions. So the best franchise for you is the one that matches what you want to achieve through the business, personally, professionally, and financially. Just like there is no one diet that works for everyone or one workout that gets everyone in shape, there is no one perfect franchise that fits everyone. The best franchise for you should be custom selected by an experienced franchise consultant. Just like anything else in life, money creates options. But more money does not equate to a better opportunity. In fact, I think some of the smaller investments have the best ROIs. There are franchise opportunities as low as 40 to 50,000 all in, and there are opportunities that cost millions. The best way to know what franchise investment you can afford is to work with an experienced franchise consultant. Financing options will depend on the type of business you are investing in, your credit score, monthly income, and net worth. In general, a third-party lender will require 20 to 30% cash injection, but that cash can come from cash, liquidated stocks, or even a 401k rollover. The 401k rollover, or ROBS program, is the number one way my candidates finance their franchise investment because it doesn't require a pre-approval based on credit score, monthly household income, or net worth. And the loan doesn't come with interest and an immediate repayment plan. Financing your investment is a personal conversation that you should have with an experienced consultant. Please do not try to finance your business on your own or do your own research. Speak with an experienced consultant that can help you know your options and get it done. I work with some of the best people in franchise lending. This is a loaded question, and for sure, there is no one reason why franchise businesses fail. Some of the common reasons include selecting the wrong business for skills, quality of life goals, and financial capability. Franchises fail because franchisees don't work the plan or follow the system. Franchises fail because life happens, such as illness, divorce, job transfers. I think occasionally franchises fail because owners get overwhelmed by ownership. They went in with a false expectation or got weighed down by the fear of uncertainty. I think some owners adopt bad mental habits early on and their attitude and self-talk is so negative that they create that which they constantly talk and think about. There are many reasons why franchise businesses fail but in all my years of franchise consulting, it usually is not the system or the franchisor. In most cases, failure is franchisee created. Success in a franchise is earned, just like success in anything else in life. You must learn the system and then master the system. You must keep a confident, positive attitude even when things are not going as planned. Success requires tenacity, focus, and a good, solid plan that can be executed day by day. Success in a business is not easy, but it is also not impossible. It is owned by those who invest in the right business for their goals and dreams, who follow the system, keep a good attitude, and never, ever give up.